Hey there, everybody. Fett here, and welcome back to Fett Plays RimWorld Beta 19. Silvermane gonna rock us out a fine meal. Look at this. The first fine meal that's ever been made. History of the universe. We made it here. Silvermane's gonna try it out right now. He's like, hmm. How tasty is this? Oh, it's quite tasty. Very nicely done, my dude. Ironheart's also gonna take a taste. She loved it, I'm assuming. Alright. I think we're gonna be okay this winter. It's kinda how we're looking, so far at least. I think so. Could we be better? Probably. I think we're doing all uh, doing okay. All right, what do you think, Rolls Stills Bulkin? You think there's plenty of stuff to clean, Miss Mask? Gonna make us some toques and some uh, parkas? Kind of just need to use that stuff up anyway. We got a lot of leather, and we're not doing anything with it. And if you're not doing anything with it, why are you having it around? Might as well try to make life a little better. Should probably just start wearing some uh, button-down shirts and some nice pants too. Got some travelers passing by, Dindler Common Covenant. How you doing, Maxwell and uh, Priscilla, the pop idol? Low male psychic drone. Thank you for telling me that in the pop-up. That's pretty great. And by pretty great, I mean it's pretty terrible. Dark Shadow, we're gonna have to watch him. He's already in a pretty bad mood. His psychite withdrawal is getting a little nuts. So, we'll just beware. Buyer beware. Decent toques are being made. Uh, Paris has decided to go on a sad walk again. He's done this once before. And honestly, it wasn't that bad last time. So I'm thinking it won't be bad this time. He's really got to leave Miss Mask alone, though. Like, seriously, dude? Need to slow down on that stuff. The chicks are eating pemmican. We still got a decent amount of pemmican, and we got a good amount of of simple meals as well. So the colonists will eat the yes confusion. The colonists will go ahead and eat the meals, I hope, and everyone else will eat the pemmican. And by everyone else, I mean the chicks, and that should last us throughout winter. I'll be quite honest with you. I'm trying to hunt another caribou, maybe another uh, muffalo. I'm not really worried about the raccoons. Bear is a little bit worrisome. You should be hibernating right now. You shouldn't be coming even near us. In fact, I think Parrish is going to need to get over his funk here soon so that I can have him fight. Ascetic has a repulsive bedroom. He loves it. He loves how garbage his bedroom is. That's why I like people who are ascetics. In fact, we could probably put the heater in there. The heater probably doesn't look good. But I don't know that for sure. Does Heater take away from beauty at all? Nah, apparently it doesn't touch it at all. Train requirement, light, whatever that means. Anyway, I assume that means maybe it can't be on things like soft ground, or can be on things like soft ground, maybe? I don't know. That's my hunch. Hey, we did use some of those chicken eggs for food. You can use the fertilized ones as well, by the way. Uh, I pro I'm sure you're already tempted not to, but... Uh, yeah, use the ones that are spoiled. Caribou Revenge. Looks like it's just one of them. So we'll likely be okay. Oh, oh we'll be okay. Iron Heart. Good lord. She's just gonna go walk right to the next one. Beat it up as well. She's made up to 13 in a shooting seal. She's almost good enough to be able to use this uh, sniper at relatively peak efficiency. What I'm trying to say is she's amazing. Thank goodness our uh, dining room is slightly impressive. We might need to start making some art soon. There we go. We used that. We used up those eggs. So let's go ahead now and uh, not. Oh, wait, there we go. Not use the fertilized ones anymore. Just because we, we've used them. Can't turn eggs into pemmican. 
I mean, it's good to know. I didn't know that. My dude. Between the drone and the withdrawal, Dark Shadow's having some bad times. Parrish is starving. Maybe Parrish should get some food. He's also about to fall on con- Okay, he's done. He's done wandering. He's eaten. He's gonna go be to bed. He'll be fine. And we got it. quite a bit of food now. That is so good. I mean, Ironheart is eventually going to be like one of the best hunters ever. She's heading that way. <laughs> there you go. A little bit more food for you animals. Yeah, I'm feeling pretty good about the chickens lasting throughout this winter. At least the number of chickens that we wanted to have last. I can't believe the boars can't haul anymore. I'm slightly upset by that, but whatever. Yeah, follow Parrish out while he hunts. He might as well. And while doing tasks, sure. Why not? The polar bear can learn how to do all that stuff. He's a little hard to tame, train because nobody can really train him. Because nobody's really good enough yet. Yeah. This thing's probably gonna go wild. Make them a waste of money. But whatever. So, are we still making... What are you making? Pants? This is a shirt? Miss Mast is working on parkas? Alright. I just want to make some warmer clothing, you know? And some decent clothing. For other times of the day. Looks like Dark Shadow's feeling a lot better now. And that Psychic Drone is over. Which is actually beautiful. <laughs> Looks like we actually need more wood. Let's go ahead and uh, give it the old choppy choppy. There we go. Beautiful. Looks like there's a ton of wild boars out here. The, uh... Looks like the bear left. I think these boars are just traveling. So since they're not good for hauling anymore, I really don't have a use for the boars. They aren't good for hauling. What are they good for? You know? Let's go ahead and take out some of this too. Wait. Gotta find out where this overhead mountain is. But we can dig all this. This is no problem. So we will do so. Looks like our, our boys were waiting for things to do. So that works out. No mountain yet. Beautiful. A little bit more steel. It's a good thing. Don't get it twisted. Alright, we don't need this. This is just rock. There's a one space area in there, and that's the rest of it, so cool. Alright. Nice little gathering of steel for us. Who's got hypothermia? Miss Mask. You can only handle down to negative three. There's actually no torches or, or anything like that in here, so... We really need you to, uh... Be more careful in there. Tell you what. I don't want to put a campfire in there. I don't really want to put the heater in there either. Yeah, I'm gonna, gonna be lazy and just put another torch in here somewhere. Peace Talks quest. Trumpet! The Prime Counselor of a Trump just sent us a message. Come talk to us. Alright, that's where we can talk. It's pretty good. You get 2,000 silver for taking this thing out, too. We got 15 days if we want to check out this prisoner camp. Problem is, there are two people, two turrets, and a mortar. I don't want to mess with that crap. We probably could take it, depending on how they were configured, but I don't know. I'm I'm questioning that ability. 
Temperature's slowly going up in here. People are putting on some better clothing, it looks like. Miss Mass, you could be one of those people. You're still wearing a freaking duster. Lady! Take off the duster. And go put on a parka. What's with you and dusters, woman? Go put on a... That one's tattered. Here, this one's not tattered yet. There you go, negative 52. Now you can freaking survive. Jeez. Some people. They just don't get it. Get a little... Eh, nah, we're still fine on Pemmican. We're over 400 still. And we got 20 simple meals. Looks like we did get some more fertilized chicken eggs, which we don't need right now. Uh, let's go ahead and cook with them. We'll cook with them until winter's over, because they're not... There's no way they're hatching during the... During the winter. It's got a big chunk of steel over here. Got some more muffalo. Let's go ahead and, uh... Knock out a couple of them. If and we can. Some elk as well. Let's go ahead and take care of one of each, maybe. Ironheart already on it. No surprise there. Ironheart also needs warmer clothes. Because it's just one degree colder than she's really used to. It's not going to stop her, though. She's got to try to hunt. God. Two shots and she actually hit it. My goodness, she's good. I didn't need that spine or body. All right. Well done. Go ahead and drop that off and then go to bed. Especially since it's uh, quite a bit cold out for you. All right. Those eggs were used. And yeah, we'll just keep that as, as that order for now. Woo! Wow, that power output when it's max wind. Good lord. 3,400. These things can only store 600 each. Used to be 1,000. But alright. That's fine. Means less problems if we get a zit. It is a little dangerous to have conduits over here exposed because they could cause explosions, but I think if I keep my crops away from them, they'll probably be fine. Probably. I don't know for sure. I don't know nothing for sure. I don't pretend to. 65%. What are you running off and butchering? Oh, they hunted it, but they didn't bring it in. I got you. Cargo pods. What you got for me? Yayo. No thanks. I mean, I could sell it, but I'd rather... I'd rather make pants! Parrish is trying his hardest to make these pants. He's just not good at it. I mean, he'll get better, but we got a lot of pretty crappy pants thanks to thanks to his lack of work. Yeah, it may have been a little bit of a waste of materials, but that's okay. Now everyone can put on pants if they need to. This mask is going to make a few more parkas. It's actually fantastic. Don't don't get it twisted. All right, down to 313 pemmican. Another egg there that will never be useful. Silvermane. Rocking up some more muffalo meat. Dude's just butchering like crazy. Look at this man go! Poor animals didn't stand a chance. All right, I guess worst, worst case scenario... We could have... Oh, you don't have anything in you. Man, she's good. We could have um, our team start cranking out simple meals forever and giving some to the chickens. That's only if we completely run out of pemmican. It's the 12th of December, though, so I think we're going to make it to the end of the year. And we should have a little bit of pemmican left. 
Now, it's not exactly growing zone yet, but we're at least going to have chickens out to the next year at the rate things are going. All right. And a daze. All right. Well, could be worse, I suppose. We should probably plan on keeping maybe a couple of these animals and just getting rid of the rest, I think. Just because... Just because... We don't want that many. Yeah. I might name some chickens and just keep them and get rid of the rest. Dude, you should go eat. Just saying, Dark Shadow. Alright. I don't want to imprison you again. I really don't. You've already been in prison recently. Let's just let you wander around and see what happens. Let's also go ahead and... Maybe not 20, but let's try to make 50 simple meals. If we do that, we can go ahead and stop making meals for the rest of this year. Probably. Maybe. I don't know. Raxo the Prairie. Hanging out. The pirate faction running around our base. Don't get it twisted. Oh, here comes the revenge. It's just the one. Thankfully. It's missing an eye. Both of its legs are shot. Run. You should be faster than it now. You should be way faster than it at this point. 2.89? That's really slow. Stupid peg leg. 2.12, you're faster. Cool. It's just gonna bleed out in five hours, so we're fine. Just gonna wander around. Don't mind me. Parrish is gonna go grab a rock. Don't mind me. Ooh, See the turret in action here. Are you Manhunter as well? No, why are you following us? What are you actually doing? You, you, you're intimidating me. Nice. So, yeah, each volley is... Each one is a bullet. Cool. Now you can go take care of it. So, now, what? Do we just reload it for free? Does, does it take steel? How does this work? Let's find out. Roll those Vulcan. After you tame that thing, let's see what happens here. Oh, it's learned how to release. Awesome. It does take steel. Well, that sucks. So... Okay. I know where you're going with this, Tynan. You're like... Hey, people were hauling up in their turrets, in their turreted filled bases too much, and people aren't dying, and because I'm actually a psychopath, I want people to die frequently. But, uh, if that's the case, why didn't you just go all in and make it so you have to reload weapons as well? I know there's a mod for that, and I want to use it soon, in the next, like, series or something like that. Combat Extended, I believe it is. Uh, but why not just make that vanilla, then, if you wanted, if you would just want to go all in? You gotta make us use ammo. Make us use ammo for everything. You half ass in it, just try, try to make the games come out the way you want it to. Like you're some kind of developer or something. You with control over your own video game, you are in the control of the market. That's how capitalism works. Don't get it twisted. We have a lamp, I should use it. Uh, I don't know where I want to put this, man. But I should use it. That's definitely true. We should have light. I kind of like the idea of having it over here. My first lamp. But it also has heat in that room. It's It would be best to put it in here somewhere. Where the heat isn't necessarily needed anymore. So we'll put it right there. Miss Mask and Wispy apparently get the best room in the house for now. There we go. 
Actually, the uh, heater does put out a little bit of heat, but very, very little. Bada bing, bada boom. There you go. You're lit, fam. Okay. Caribou Braga Braga visiting the colony. How you doing? Braga Braga. We could build more lamps too. I mean we could we could build them. They only take 30 watts. Wouldn't hurt. Yeah, you know what? Let's go ahead and replace all these with lamps. What's 30 watts between friends? There we go. Just a better source, and a source of less, uh, lump of slate. Beautiful. Less, uh, less wood usage as well. Considering we still use wood for the fueled stove and for the fueled smithy. Be good to have that around. There you go, we made some simple meals. Look at us go. At the 14th of December now. Can you handle this cold? Negative seven? I mean, barely, but yeah. Got some hares and some rats. Might as well hunt them. I don't want to take out any more muffalo, I don't think, but we'll take care of an Ibex doe. You're still up and walking around? You are a moron. Fall down, Dark Shadow! Dude, I don't want to imprison you again, but you're making it really hard. So our Pemmican is just barely going to make it past this, uh... This year. But we start putting simple meals in there next. So it's fine. It's not very e efficient, but it's fine. The wild boar's been eating the Pemmican, too. I didn't even realize that. I should have, but I did not. Dark Shadow is actually factually awake. He's become sane again. <laughs> He's fallen down. Okay. Cool. Let's, um... Wispy. I can't pick him up. Dude, he needs his malnutrition taken care of. Rostel's Vulcan wants to be able to hunt, but he does not have a ranged weapon. I think that's fine. I don't need him to hunt. Not right now, at least. Parrish is just idle. Dark Shadow sleeping on the floor. People just walking right over him. He's got advanced starvation. I can't barely think about anything but food except sleep because I've fallen asleep and I can't get up. What if I draft? Could I then, like, I could try to arrest him. That's not what I want to... Okay, he's actually down. Okay. Perish. No, no. Wispy. Rescue him. Silvermane. I want to put this... You know what? Rolstow's bull can take the gun for now. You don't have a ranged weapon. That worked out perfectly. Yeah, shove some food in him. We got a war merchant from Braxo the Prairie showing up. There you go. You're gonna live. And his mood's gonna be relatively okay. Is he up already? He is. Wow, that was fast. Playing the game of Ur. The game of Ur. Not a game. So that's the last of the pemmican. Don't get it twisted. There's a cougar out here. You might want to do something about it. By might want, I mean we might need to do something about it. Alright. Getting a little... Oh, okay, those belong to the war merchant. I was... I was gonna be a little, uh, little concerned there for a minute. I'm happy I don't need to be. <laughs> okay. Perish, my dude. My dude with the words. Throw your words on this, uh, person here. They got cougars. Yes, they do. They got cougars. I'm gonna sell my polar bear. We don't have the minimum handling skill. Cougars require six. We don't have enough for that either. Boomalopes. You know. 
you milk to produce chem fuel very carefully. I don't really want it. We could have it. Uh, let's see. What else do they got? Some pilas. I don't... I mean... Sell some cruddy clothing, do you? Here, hey, want some pants? Want some crap pants? We got crap pants. Uh, I guess that's one way to make money. Sell crap pants. I mean, it's working. Should it be? I don't know about that, but it is. You know what? What is this Fumalo beat? Veggie, seeds, live plants. I don't... I can't really afford to take on another... You know what? We'll buy your pemmican, and then we'll buy your boomalope. Yeah! There you go! There you go! Now you're thinking with gas. That's how thinking works, right? Let's sell them a normal toque. It's a little worn. Sell them one of these dusters as well. And you know what? One of these parkas, sure. Make sure we're making a little bit of money. But hey, we got... A boomalope. Yes, we do. We got a boomalope. How about you? Keep it in the home area, please. In fact, uh, yeah, I can, I can hit, wander basically wherever. I don't really want to teach it to obey or release. I just want it to give us chem fuel. And that's what it will do. Eventually, over time. It is 8 years old with a life expectancy of 15. Sounds like a good investment to me. Chicken just ate, got food poisoning, and fell on its ass. Oh, poor chicken. The poor chicken. But hey, we got pemmican. That's what's important. Also, the solar generator broke down. There's n literally nothing we can do about it. Because we don't have components yet. Someday we will. Not right now. All right. Put lamps in these rooms here. Cargo pods dropped us some bear meat. I'm not saying no to it. I just didn't think I needed that. Oh, God. Dang it. Fibrous mechanites. So fibrous mechanites cause a lot of pain. They do actually improve... Well, no. Wait. Check someone else. There we go. Yes, they do actually improve manipulation, movement, and blood pumping. And they make you tired. So there are good points to them, but they're not good. I don't like them, is what I'm trying to get at here. Now, once they've been treated, they can just get up and walk around and act normal, but... Cougar is hunting a hen for food. Sounds like a job for Parrish, Ironheart, and Rolstol's Vulcan. Really? Alright. Works for me. Didn't even try. It didn't even try to fight back. I'm not here to tell them what to do. Alright, we dropped that gun. I guess Dark Shadow can pick it back up. When you're done cooking your whatever. There you go. We're basically playing past the pistol. Caravan's leaving. See you later. Thank you for the uh, pemmican. Making that clothing actually turned out extraordinarily well for us. So let's make... Not a hundred... Let's make ten more pairs of pants. And hopefully they will, uh... Be slightly better. In fact, you know... When it comes to tailoring... How about you just not perish? You can practice with other things. Yeah, Silvermane, don't do it either. I know you were working on this uh, button-down shirt, but... That's really a mismasked thing to do. She's the best at it. And that's how it that's how it will be. Rostos Bulkin just straight up can't walk. This is not a good time for a raid. Why can't you oh you're meditating? Why can't he walk? I 
I don't understand why he can't walk. Huh. Anyway, it's the gauntlet, men. Again. They brought five people. Oh, you could just do this to see their guns. Pump shotgun! Holy jeez. Bolt action rifle and a revolver. Alright, well that's pretty bad. So there you are. You're gonna be able to come down this way. They also have a couple of melee weapons, but I'm not concerned about those. I'd really like... Eh, a bolt action rifle is not too good. The revolver is pretty bad. Actually, all those weapons are pretty garbage. Bolt action is definitely the scariest weapon they have. Let's bring Ironheart over here. That might give you the best angle. Silvermane here. Miss Mask, you don't have a weapon. And we don't have one for you. So I think I'm just going to let you go about your business. Tell you what. Ironheart, get out here. See if you can't give him an initial shot. Really? Alright. So we're made in Paris. You two go up here. I want... I want to get at least one or two of them to come down this way. Come on. Oh, now they're coming down this way. I'm actually upset. There we go. All right, Dark Shadow got a couple of good starting shots there. This angle actually works out extremely well for us, it looks like. All right. Parish, go ahead and take on Krieger. Excellent. Get ready to frick over frick. They're running. Good job, guys. On draft. Let's see if you can take out this person. What, what's your hit? On your leg? Oh, you're not going to be able to chase him down. Don't worry about it, dude. You did well. All right. On forbid all this junk. Go ahead and capture Eric. He's 25. He's not missing anything. He's a tough brawler, so he's very good at melee. We have another guard coming in here soon. We also got the uh, devil horns, so that's pretty great. Grab this boy. All right. These weapons aren't that impressive. But this bolt-action rifle does have pretty darn good accuracy for its range. So I think it is still maybe an upgrade for Silvermane. Tell you what. In fact, uh, when you're done, go ahead and switch out your weapon. And then Miss Mask can actually take your uh, great bow. The revolver, I mean, it's also fine. Its accuracy is actually pretty garbage in most ways. All right, how you doing? Recruitment difficulty is actually extraordinarily low. Try to reduce your resistance for a while and just take it easy first. All right, it's only refrigerated outside right now, or at least in our cold area, which is a Big change of pace. Alright. Eric is going to be fine. So the next step is just trying to recruit him. Will we be able to do so? Well, I guess that's something we'll have to find out later. Because that is going to be it for this episode of That Plays RimWorld Beta 19. If you enjoyed it, make sure you let me know by giving a like. If you haven't already, feel free to subscribe for more. Because it's uh, RimWorld. And you know what? It's going to keep coming. And it won't stop coming. Thank you again for watching this episode of That Plays RimWorld Beta 19. My name is Thet. Here's a muffalo. And I will see you in the next video.